I've had a great experience with Skating Strides and I think it's a really important cause that we've all been involved with. It's been a really positive thing for our whole team and all the events that we get to do has really brought us closer and helps us work toward a common goal. I've also been able to get my friends and family involved with friends of Mel back home and my mom does foster care and my foster siblings raised 800 and, or they sold 878 candy bars to help raise money for skating strides and they raised over $400. I think skating strides has been really successful among hockey's teams because we're all so competitive with each other on the ice that we bring that to skating strides and we all want to compete and raise the most money and also I think it's successful because breast cancer affects one in every eight women and it's a really important issue and especially for our team, a few of our um, team members, families and close friends have been affected by breast cancer so we all feel it's really important and we do our best to do what we can to help out. My favorite Skating Strides event has been the Skating Strides Clinic. And this year, we're expecting over 100 kids to show. And we'll do on-ice and off-ice skills. And it's really fun working with all the kids. And they look up to us so much. And we just help them become aware of the issue and get them to come to our games. So we just have a lot of fun with it. And it's something we don't always get to do. It's something different. Well, um, down in Florida, we were thinking about how to um, establish a fan base for, for hockey, women's hockey, on everybody's campus. And we thought that, you know, if we combined it with a cause, that people could jump on board and it would create more atmosphere for our fan base. And obviously, you know, we want all of our student athletes involved with community service. And uh, we thought it was a terrific way uh, to give back. I think that myself and, and my coaching staff and our players have just become very passionate about uh, raising awareness of, of breast cancer and, and trying to raise as much funds as we possibly can. But I think we've made it more of a team thing um, and kids have been very creative in their ideas of coming up with ways to, to raise money. Last year though when we did do the Skating Strides Clinic uh, there was a woman here that was, was helped by a necessity bag that from on, our fundraising it helped her and um, she had three daughters that were now getting involved in hockey. So I guess that was a top, but I also liked some of the moments with my student athletes creating Storm the Dorms um, and just their, their passion that they've brought from uh, selling pink skates, um, wearing the pink jersey. So I think the whole thing has been um, a win-win for, for everybody here at UConn. I think that we always need to give back. We also know that uh, cancer affects every family um, and I think this has just helped raise the awareness for ourselves that um, you can make a difference in other people's lives and, and I think that's important that you know somebody's made a difference in your life as a student athlete and our student athletes should remember that and always want to give back and, and, and be a part of something that's bigger than themselves.